Türkiye'nin ancak dizişleri. Lütfen enişmeler, Leo Bell and Barbie, for us, and for a future generation to come. Keeping this in mind, the Department of Forestry and Environment Science, the University of Sri Java and Nepal, has organized the annual symposium successfully this year as well. So, we want to welcome you all to the 14th International Forestry and Environment Symposium 2009. Keeping with our traditions and culture, we will now start the inaugural session by right in the session of the Dean of the Arts Faculty, Professor Korella. These are the categories, Category Management Arts, Radio Studies, Registrar, Professors, Kids of the Department, Lecturers, Participants, Students, and those who are joining with us over the internet. Since 1995, we have been conducting this annual Forest and Environment Symposia and we are proud that we have been able to continue this for the 14th time this year. Normally uh, we con conduct this uh, <coughs> symposia in some luxury hotels but the reason that uh, we are conducting here in Java the University is twofold. One is the financial support, other one is but we are celebrating the 50th Jubilee. I think uh, we have been conducting several events from February and this must be the last event for the uh, 50th Jubilee of this great incident. And uh, we are also happy to conduct this annually because we get all of your knowledge. You know this is an this is a any information or knowledge era, what we call. Uh, this year we have uh, about 180, we got about uh, more than 200 papers over our internet website. And uh, from that we have shortlisted, I think, uh, two day proceedings, we have been presenting about 160 papers. And we have got uh, originally papers from uh, about 10 countries, and I think uh, in two day session uh, we are getting about participants from about uh, five or six countries and so uh, on. But I, uh, we, we, we were going through and reading the papers, but I have to stress two points here. What we are addressing is that to solve the environment problems in the world, both in Sri Lanka and nationally and globally, uh, one important thing is the innovativeness of the researchers. We have to some of the research were very innovative. Uh, other one is the reaching this research results to the general public. This year is a special event because we are broadcasting this one live over the internet. We have three parallel sessions. In this room we are uh, webcasting live from the our university uh, internet webcast channel and other two sessions we are using uh, screencasting software over the internet. And this is a new era, as you know, that we said the, in the 1.0 era, where the company, uh, where the 
countries have invaded other countries. In the second era, companies have uh, influence over the other people. Now in this knowledge era, what we call 3.0 era, where the individual can create content and disengage. Earlier, if you want to do this kind of live telecast, you need a lot of capital investment. Here in the webcast team, we have about uh, four or five people, myself, Dr. Meegam, Manoj, uh, Mudita, and Priyanka. We have been able to four times we are webcasting, we were able to webcast uh, Deep Edward and uh, Cultural TV. And also, last week, we had a very impressive uh, academic conference where some of the finest thoughts in Sri Lanka were discussed there. And Vice Chancellor accepts me, I was not able to come to the conference, but I was watching over the internet. Following these proceedings over live, and we will present these things on over the internet. We, we have a separate YouTube channel. We are going to promote this one. So, I will, uh, your content you give it to us, and we will make sure that this content will be published properly. From 1995 to 2008, all symposium abstracts are now in the internet. Any researcher can watch, but sadly, researchers themselves are unaware of. Please type your name on the Google, and your research paper will appear in our websites. And there are a lot of researchers over the world are commenting on your papers. The comments are come to me. We are publishing the content. If you have comments on those papers, please visit the website and reply the other individual co-workers. Most of the research are conducted in so most the countries. Uh, but we sadly say the uh, promotion driven research. But what we want to change the world. If you want to change the world, we have to give this, this knowledge to the general public. Over the media, we can do general public and also we have uh, taken responsibility of webcasting this one live and also putting this one in the our internet websites. But if you do not want to put these things on public domain, please tell us. Uh, then we will uh, not publish this one over the internet. But otherwise, if you are free, free to uh, put this one in the public domain, some of the, because if you have seen the YouTube, uh, we, uh, recently I was uh, looking for differential equations. The top uh, presentation was from IIT, not MIT. IIT from India. So the individual content creation doesn't matter where you are living. Whether you are living in Ambatata or New York, it doesn't matter. If you have the good content, we have the responsibility to dissemination your content, but the content is up to you. People should watch. Now I think if uh, some cultural show will be telecast, it will watch, but we have to watch. Uh, and some of the people will not realize the true potential of this true thing. Because when we were going to the other two webcasting, when we were webcasting, we had a small camera with one person operating there. But there were other very sexy cameras with good light systems. And we, I asked him, can we please borrow your channel to telecast? He said, what is this? He did not give us because it was properly paid. And it was lying. Those, all these things are lying in a tape and viewed by four, three people, like wedding or something. But our one was live watching over the internet where we had primitive equipment, but it doesn't matter. This is how we can change the world. Individuals can change the world. That is this 3.0 era. In future, Sri Lanka can play a big role in this kind of information dissemination. Our symposium also is similar to that. We have voluntarily published over the internet, and these all researchers internationally, they have voluntarily submitted their